what we've got. So I might as well get the light on it. Let's just get the light on it. And at least it'll be a couple of microns above zero. And as I say, you'll have to excuse the music again. But hey. Right then. So what we've got here is the uh, real life. <laughs> nah. So we've got the four bolts ready and there's the four bolts down there and uh, obviously our motor which is now properly mounted, bolted on, fixed in place and that's not going anywhere. Got some nice heavy duty welds on that as you can see. So we'll make sure that doesn't go anywhere. I was contemplating actually welding it down but I think uh, that might be a bit too much. Anyway, and I've, I've shaken it around and it's not falling off, so I think we're okay. I don't think I need to put any more strengtheners on it. And this is the coupling. So we've got a plate here, and that will go on to, say, there, and then the other plate, which will go on to the top, and then we've got the two bars, which will be welded to those, so they'll rotate with them. And then we've got four strips, and what it is is these will be in pairs, and that one end, one end will attach on that side, and the other end will attach onto the one above it. So that might, for instance, that one might happen, might weld on onto there, and the other one will be to the underside of the other one, which will go across the top. And they'll be so that they can move. And the idea is that this will flex, you see, so that this will bend up, you see, and thus that will transmit the power. I'll have to make sure I get the right way around. Okay. But it's on and it's turning and it's top. <laughs> what a structure. Let's get it in. Get the proper thing in. And there'll be a diagram alongside this so you can see it alongside the diagram. But that's the beast. Yeah. Okay, that'll do.